Hi everybody, it's Heather. Welcome back to Troll Fit at Home. We're so excited to have you here. Today we have a 20 minute sculpt session up for you and you don't need anything except for a mat, a towel, and a chair. Everything that we're gonna do today is body weight friendly, so get all of your things ready and meet me on your mat. We're gonna start off with a quick warm up. Bring your feet hips width distance apart, arms at your sides, and slowly roll your head around to the left hand side. Big inhale through your nose, and even larger exhale through your mouth. We'll switch it to the other way. Big inhale through your nose, even larger exhale through your mouth. One more, roll it all the way around, finally resting your chin to your chest, slowly bring your head up. Big inhale, arms come all the way up to the ceiling for your mountain pose. Relax your shoulders here. Side bend to the right hand side, really stretch it through. Feel your oblique stretch right through the side. On your next breath, you pull both arms up, reach all the way up to your ceiling. And on your exhale, side bend to the left hand side. Feel this stretch all the way along your right oblique. On your next breath, both arms come all the way back up. And as you exhale, we start right into high knees for the warm up. Right here, it's right, lift, left. Right, and left. Pull your core in, drive your knees up, and pretend like there's no gravity here. You're actively pushing against the air. It's right, left, right, and left. Just warming everything up. For eight, seven, six, five. Speed it up in four, three, two, and one. Speed it up. It's right, lift, left, right. And left, right, left, right, and left. Come on, everybody, right, and left, right, and left. Keep it here for eight, seven, six, five. Shake it out in four, three, two, and one. We shake it out right here. How are we feeling? Okay, grab a sip of water if you need it. We're gonna head right into our first standing series here. You're gonna take your right leg, kick it up, and down, toe tap, bring it down, tap it here. As you're tapping your core is pulling all the way, and you're feeling this in your thighs and in your quads. We lift, and tap, lift, and tap. Speed it up, up, lift, lift. We squeeze it. And as with anything in sculpt, we add on. For four, three, two, and one. We add on, you kick it up, reverse lunge. Same leg, lunge, kick it up, and lunge. We kick it up, and lunge, kick, and lunge, kick, and lunge. For eight, seven, and back. Six, bring it back. Five, and back. It's four. Three, we pulse back in two. And one, we pulse back for eight, seven, six, five. Leg taps in four. Three, two, and one. Core pulls in, we hold it right here. Right leg taps in and out. It's out. In, out, in. All of that weight is on your left leg right here. Out, in. For eight, seven, six, five. To the side in four, three, two, and one. To the side for eight, seven, six, five. It's four, three. Combo movement in two, and one. All together, it's back. Side, back, and side for eight, seven, six, five. It's four, three, last two, and one. We come down into our squat. Your core pulls in right here. See how low we can sink. Your heels are in, your toes are out. You're tight right here. And it's a static hold for eight, seven, sink it lower, six, five. It's four, three, heel raise in two, and one, heel raise. It's the right heel, 
the left heel, right, and left, sink it lower, right, left, right, and left. You should be feeling this in your core, in your quads, in your inner and outer thighs, and your calves. For eight, seven, six, five, hold it high, and four, three, two, and one. Great job, bring both heels up. We hold it right here. For eight, seven, six, five, arms out in four, three, two, and one. Arms out for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, last two, and one. We bring our heels down, we come all the way up, shake it out, your legs coming together, grab a sip of water if you need, and then we're gonna switch onto that left leg. We tap it up and down. Tap your left leg and down. Bring it up and down. It's up and down. Just like last time, you're pulling your core in as tight as you can, and know that we're gonna add on shortly. In eight, and down. Seven, bring it down. It's six, and down. Five, and down. It's four, three. Add the lunge in two, and one. We have a lunge right here. It's up, lunge back, kick it up, lunge back, kick up, lunge back. Bring it here, and back, kick up, and back. Your core is tight this whole time. Lunge back, kick it up for eight, seven, six, five. We pulse in four, three, two, and one. We hold it right here. We pulse and pulse. Your core is holding right here. We hinge forward, forearm tap, in and out. In, in, out, in, out. Left leg tapping. Core is pulled in tight. Right here. For four. Three. Left side in two. And one. To the side. It's out, in, out, in. Core. For eight, seven, six. Five, together in four, three, two, and one. It's back, side, back, side, for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. We come back into our squat, core pulls in. You sink as low as you can. We're back here to our static hold for eight. Seven, I know it's burning. Six, five, four. Heel raises in three, two. Get it even lower. Last one, right heel, left heel, right heel for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Both heels come up, we hold. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Arms come out. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. We bring it all the way back up. Shake out your legs. I know they're hurting. Grab a quick sip of water and then meet me back on your back. We're gonna do some quick cardio here, and then we're gonna take it to the chair. All right, inhale through your nose. Big exhale through your mouth. You're gonna meet me here for our cardio sequence. We're gonna start off with star jumps. It's out, in, out, in, out, in, right here. For eight, seven, six, five, it's four, three squat jumps in two, and one, squat jumps, we lift, 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 and lift. Power through your lower body, getting as high as you can. For four, three, last two, and one. We head into a combo, it's out, up, out, up, out, up, out. And up for eight, seven, 
shake it out. How are we doing at home? I know we're feeling it. Grab some water and then meet me over at your chair. We're gonna start off with simple leg raises. Core pulls in, right leg. We lift, tap, lift, and tap. Squeezing your glute as hard as you can. Using the support of the chair to really focus on your glutes and pulling in your core. Lift it up and down for eight, seven, six, five, I feel it, I don't know about you, four, three, it's two, and one. It's a standing hydrant to your elbow, kick back. Elbow, kick it back for eight, seven, six, five, hips stay straight, four, three, two, and one. You go ahead and plant your right leg down. Your hands come to the body of the seat. We're gonna do incline push-ups. We lower and press, lower and press, and down, and up. Your head is the last thing to come up. 
And when it does, we start to roll our shoulders all the way back for four, three, two, and one. We roll it forward for four, three, last two, and one. On your next breath, bring your left arm right across your chest. Squeeze it right behind the elbow. Feel this stretch out our triceps. We just did 10 push-ups on each side. Hold for eight, seven, six, five, it's four, three, last two, and one. Sweating all the makeup into my eyes. Your right arm crosses over. Squeeze it right behind that elbow. We hold it again for eight. Option to roll out your wrist here for eight, seven, six, five, four, it's three, last two, and one. On your next breath, release both hands down to your sides. We're going to turn it into the right and come right back into your front lunge. Knee is right over ankle. Your core is pulled in. Your hands are going to frame both sides of your right foot here. We just hold for four, three, two, and one. Inhale your right arm all the way up. Feel this nice oblique stretch right here. For four, three, last two, and one. Your right hand comes back down. And we slowly walk our hands right over back into the center. Give yourself another hamstring stretch right here. We switch to the right side and center. Left side and center for our eight. Seven, six, five, it's four, three, left side in two, and one. On your next breath, you slowly walk it over to the left hand side. We come right back into that front lunge. Your hands frame either side of your left foot, and we hold it right here for eight, seven, six, five, last four, three, final two, and one. Left arm comes all the way up. Feel that stretch for four, three, two, last one. Bring your left hand right, in, right into the center. Your hands walk right back in to your hamstring stretch. You once again, heel toe your feet back in together. Give yourself another long stretch. We slowly roll it right back up to standing, bone by bone. Your head is the last thing to come up. And once it's here, give yourself a round of applause because you crushed it. Yes. All right, Troll family, we did that shit, okay? 20 minutes of skull. Congratulate yourself. You did it. Thank you for showing up. Thank you for working out with me virtually. We got glutes, abs, arms, quads. We did a whole lot on the chair. So please, as you're looking around in your home, know that anything there is equipment for you to use. You don't need weights. You don't need any of that. We can use everyday things and have them work for us and build a better, stronger workout. So thank you again. If you like this workout, please check out our other ones as well. I recommend doubling, tripling up, maybe do sculpt in the morning, cardio dance at night, whatever feels good for you. I'm Heather, thank you again for joining my class and I will see you again.